Jennifer Lopez, when finally discussing her husband Ben Affleck's chronic alcoholism, reveals that Ben is not in a good place. Ben Affleck has been struggling with alcoholism for a very long time, but Ben insisted he had put all of his addiction problems in the past when he started dating Jennifer Lopez again in 2021. Ben was recently seen arguing with her at a party in Hollywood when she appeared to want to check his drink for alcohol, which has led to claims that he is still fighting with his past demons. Jennifer Lopez is apparently at her wit's end and worn out from continuously watching over Ben, according to recent reports. So what exactly did Jennifer Lopez say regarding Ben's drinking issue? Could this lead to their marriage falling apart? You'll know more about all of this in this video, but first, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Let's start the video right away. Just over six months have passed since Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck exchanged vows in Las Vegas, 18 years after their first engagement failed. In a recent interview with Zane Lowe, Jennifer talked about her marriage to Ben and said that this time, it's forever. But there are currently claims that Ben Affleck's severe alcohol problem is still causing him to struggle with his marriage to Jennifer Lopez. Ben Affleck's Addiction History Now let's go over some previous stories to get you up to speed before we discuss what Jennifer Lopez had to say about Ben's drinking issue. Ben Affleck comes from a long history of alcoholics and people with mental illnesses. His paternal grandmother committed suicide at the age of 46 after developing an alcohol and barbiturate addiction. Both Ben's aunt and his paternal uncle committed suicide after suffering with addiction. Then, throughout Ben's childhood, his father, Timothy, too battled serious alcoholism. In one interview, Ben described how his father drank continuously. Ben claimed that his father was quite difficult, so when his parents divorced and his father left the family home at the age of 11, Ben was glad. Timothy continued to drink excessively and finally became homeless spending two years living on the streets of Cambridge, Massachusetts. When Ben was 16 years old, his father ultimately checked himself into a recovery center in Indio, California, where he spent the next 12 years before turning to an addiction counselor. Unfortunately, Ben and Casey, Timothy's sons, also developed drinking habits at the same time he was finally able to stop drinking. Ben's mother sent him to a wilderness camp for teenagers at risk when he was 15 years old, since he was already consuming too much alcohol. When he was 18, Ben came to Los Angeles to pursue acting, and a few years later, when his career began to take off, Ben made the decision to become sober. Ben entered residential treatment for his alcoholism following the popularity of goodwill hunting and was able to maintain his sobriety for a few years. Ben, however, fell into the trap of believing that he could occasionally drink like the majority of people. The occasional glass of wine with supper quickly developed into a complete relapse, and according to Ben, he began drinking until he was unconscious every day. Meanwhile, Ben and J-Lo's two-year relationship reportedly came to an end in 2004 only days before their wedding date as a result of increased media attention. Addiction while being married to Jennifer Garner After meeting Jennifer Garner on the Pearl Harbor set, Ben began dating her a few months later. Ben and Jennifer Garner got married in a tiny private ceremony with only two other guests in attendance in June 2005. Daughters Violet Ann, Serafina Rose, and boy Samuel Garner were born after they got married. Ben continued to drink extensively after getting married and having children. And despite Jennifer's best efforts to rehabilitate him, Ben kept relapsing. In addition to Ben's heavy drinking having a significant impact on the family, rumors that Ben had an extramarital affair with Jennifer's nanny surfaced in early 2015. Although she insisted that the nanny scenario wasn't the primary cause of her and Ben's breakup, Jennifer later hinted that the cheating allegations were truly genuine. Despite everything Ben put Jennifer Garner through, she continued to support him on his journey to sobriety and even allowed him to live in a guest house at her house for two more years after they split up in June 2015, despite their separation. Ben went back to residential therapy in the meantime, but soon after finishing the course, he experienced another relapse. Jennifer was there to take care of everything once again and she took him directly to rehabilitation. However, in October 2018, Ben finished a 40-day program. Nevertheless, in 2019, TMZ spotted Ben stumbling after a Halloween party on a Los Angeles street. Ben, though, insisted that this was simply a little slip and resolved to keep up his recuperation schedule. In the meantime, Ben reconciled with his former fiancée, Jennifer Lopez, and in July 2021, they made their relationship known to the public. In an interview with Howard Stern later that year, 
Ben disclosed his addiction and asserted that he had been totally sober since the beginning of 2020. Yet, during that same interview, Ben insulted his ex-wife Jennifer Garner and suggested that he had been binge drinking during their marriage because he felt trapped. Well, this is not it. There's more to this. According to Ben, he would still be drinking if they were married. The public was outraged, despite Ben's attempts to defend himself and claim that his remarks were misinterpreted. Jennifer Garner was one person who never gave up on Ben, never disparaged him in public, and even when he cheated on her and destroyed their family with his alcoholism, she was still there to drive him to rehab and shield him from the paparazzi. In addition, Casey, Ben's brother, also acknowledged that Jennifer was the one who initially motivated Ben to seek sobriety. Fans began thinking that Ben wasn't as sober as he claimed to be after the Howard Stern interview because an addict would often use his marriage and his ex-wife as an excuse for their drinking issues. Ben and his new spouse, Jennifer Lopez, both insisted that Ben is now totally sober and in better health than ever. In the summer of 2022, only a few months after being married, some media outlets reported that the couple was always arguing and that J-Lo was growing impatient with Ben. Ben is the complete opposite of Jennifer, who has stated numerous times that she never consumes alcohol and that she is obsessed with working out. One source previously told Radar Online in September that J-Lo was particularly irritated with Ben's smoking habit. A month or so later, a different insider informed the outlet that J-Lo and Ben had been fighting constantly since their wedding. According to the insider, J-Lo is a perfectionist, whereas Ben is totally the opposite in terms of personality and way of life. Ben doesn't clean up after himself, which irritates the hell out of Jennifer, the insider told. The couple recently got into a huge fight after J-Lo completely blindsided Ben and got rid of his prized motorbike collection because she thought it was unsafe. She's been known to yell at him and point her finger. It makes people wonder if she mistakes him for the dog, the insider added. In the meantime, J-Lo persisted in putting on a cheerful front in public, declaring that she is fortunate to have another chance at love with Ben and that she's happier than ever. The latest viral video. Jennifer Lopez and Ben Affleck were recently observed having what appeared to be an argument in the middle of the after-party for J-Lo's movie Shotgun Wedding, and it was supposedly triggered by Ben's drinking. A viral video of J-Lo and Ben is currently becoming popular on social media. In the video, J-Lo appears to be checking to see if Ben's drink contains alcohol. And at one point, it appears as though Ben is telling her, I didn't drink anything, Jen. Once more, rumors are surfacing that Ben is battling an alcohol problem and that J-Lo is getting weary of continually keeping an eye on him. According to people close to Jennifer Lopez, she is worried about Ben's alcoholism and is concerned that he would relapse, especially now that they are married and Ben has previously claimed that feeling trapped in a marriage is what drove him to drink until he passed out. Fans' Reaction While there is disagreement among fans about this, some of them appreciate J-Lo for keeping Ben in check, while others claim that she rushed Ben into marriage before he had time to fully recover from all of his problems. One fan said, I support Jen in this because it just means she cares about his sobriety. Whoa, I hope her love for him gives her the patience to get through this problem. I love love and wish them all the love they need to get through this. However, another person commented, He always appears absolutely miserable, and I'm sure he makes everyone around him miserable too, as alcoholics tend to do. I think alcohol isn't his only problem. Final thoughts. From the recent viral clip, it's safe to assume that Ben hasn't overcome his alcohol addiction yet, and he should definitely seek a rehabilitation facility. That's all we've got for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel before you leave.